Piper wants to set up Umio with somebody, and of course I'm gonna make her set up him with Nami. It's like their billionth date, I think. Uh, but I am still gonna persist whenever the opportunity shows up. Even if it just means they're gonna start to slightly become more friendly. Um, dang. They are just stubborn. They do not want to become a couple. But I'm gonna persist anyway. They both will remain single for as long as it takes until they're together. They're no longer single with each other. Or whatever. Dang. I wonder how many dates they've been on at this point. Thanks for hanging out today. Oof. And not just for Piper. Well, they're, well, they got the hint a little bit that I want them to get along, right? Why can't we all just get along? Dang, they are stubborn. There are some memories I'd love to forget. Hey, so embarrassing. I know, right? And only kind of getting along once again with Dexter. Speaking of which, I wonder how he feels. And he has a problem, too. And Henry the Ace is hungry. No surprise. But hopefully for the last creamy stew I got. And he liked it a lot. <laughs> well, there we go. I was about to say, you want to be living in these apartments, right? If that were the case. And Draven was probably tw twerking just then. And he's like, right. He's hungry too. Um, hopefully for cotton candy. <laughs> and he didn't really like it. Saying I'm tired makes me feel instantly about a hundred times more tired. Relatable AF. Still friends. Really, the last time I saw, she didn't seem to. She seemed to want to forget you, which is kind of harsh. And now Nami is gonna ask why on earth I made her go on another date with him. She just answered her own question. Why would just by go? saying that. Want me to go out with Yumio? Really? You might be wrong. Now I'm curious. <laughs> I wonder if it's possible for two me to remarry. Like if they divorced once, they can marry again to each other. I don't even know if that's possible, but it might. That they might fall back in love with each other at a later date after divorcing the first time round. Thanks for being so nice. Please accept this token of my gratitude. <laughs> well, at least she gives me a gold coin while we're at it. Why is it so excited time. and so emotional exactly because it's so fleeting? And I, my mind wasn't even in the right place to truly get what she was saying just then, but you know. Won't you please play with me? Sure, why not? Double food and treasure shadow play. Dang it. What are these? Uh, the correct it is. certainly didn't look like a crab. Some chattery teeth and a needed eraser. Next up, your second mystery shadow. Hmm. What are these? Uh, the correct answer is a bangle and a quartz topper. And finally, the last mystery shadow. Hmm. What are these? Uh, certainly didn't look like a diamond, unfortunately. And some coconut? Did he just say some coconut and not some co coconut, plural? Well, I think he just made a, gra a, a, a grammatical error then. If that is the case, of course. Which it might be, but I wasn't paying attention enough. And now Antoine is, is uh... No. Have a problem for whatever reason. That's in my pants. Or that. What should I say when I'm happy? Yeah, speaking of which. Uh. Uh. I 
I guess I already have an idea of what he'll say when he's worried. But just in the meantime, this one is gonna be lame. Unintentionally lame. I have pants? <laughs> no sheep. But either way. Just going with Sometimes the anthem pants theme. Like Weird kind of. And they are still in love, seemingly. Uh, and she's hungry. And the wifey is hungry. Dang, I've never given her a banana before until now. And she liked it. Dance that is. 